Honda E, oh my days. I've been dreaming about this car ever since I've seen it. It's absolutely amazing. And it's the first time I've ever driven an electric car. So it's keyless start like all cars are. So just literally over here, I'm just gonna push the start button. So pedal down, brake on, start button. It's quiet. So we're just gonna have a look at the screen here. Like, whew. all right, okay, so we start the screen. And then we're going to have it all nice. We've got our volume there for the radio, so we'll turn that down. Over here, we don't have a mirror. We have a screen. So the screen is literally the mirror, and there's a camera outside. And then we've got this whole screen across the dashboard. Beautiful monitor all the way across. So over here, we've got our other mirror, which again is just a camera. Right, so now I'm going to drive the car. So I've pushed this D button just down here, and this D button... All the controls, D, neutral, reverse, park, and there we go. So, um, put it into drive, check, check, check. Let's go, move, 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 thank you very much. All right, all round observations, and off we go. Oh my God, it's so quiet. 64%, so we're gonna drive for about 10 minutes. Let's see how far down on the meter we get. We've got a nice little dog. The dog's so comfortable, it got really close to the car. I don't know if that's a good thing or a little bit of zip on this one. It's so quiet. Stay there, brother. Stay there, brother. Oh my God, this car feels amazing to drive. So light, the steering's so comfortable. Oh, look at that camera. Oh my God, it's so good, the camera. It's unreal, like, I could just see that whole blue car just in the center, so colorful and so vivid that it actually makes a bigger impact when you see it. That is sick, like, oh man, I can't wait for all cars to have cameras on them like this. Around, 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 around. No, we're gonna go on the A4 real quick. We're gonna get this thing up to 70 miles an hour. Oh, look at this, oh my God. So in the camera here, as I'm joining, it's showing me, I turned the signal off, but it's showing me spacing. There was lines there. And there's the blind spot cam, or the warning sensor telling me that there's someone in my blind spot. Okay, so we're at 82% now. Okay, so we're almost on the motorway. Let's see how this puppy performs at 70 miles an hour. Come on guys, thank you everyone for coming so far. Right, I'm going to move out, there's my little uh, lines there showing me the distance from the vehicle. Excellent. Right, now we put the hammer. Oh, the smokies. Oh my goodness. Seriously? First time I'm driving electric. Yeah, look at that, I love those lines. You see the lines, the little red lines? They show you car lengths. So ideally what you want is that car behind you to be at that far line, like you can see now on the camera. And then that's roughly a safe distance for, that's such a good teaching aid. That This car will be an absolute amazing car to learn to drive in. It looks like it's got a light in it, this beam here. Um, from what I've been told as well, so this is leather, it's got all the buttons, all your cruise control, all your media buttons here, just like the um, Mercedes as an example. Oh, I'm trying to use the Mercedes tech there. I was trying to squeeze the brake to get the whole technology. Uh, 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 not going to work in this car. That one. I'm going to push that and now I'm good. So now I think if I push the gas, yay, go forward. So we stop. Push brake hold. Le ah, what happened? Brake hold. Okay, yeah. now it's working. The screen shows us brake hold. 
and then we just push the gas and we're off and there's no sound i like no sound how the hell am i saying that i don't oh that's so weird coming from somebody that loves fossil fuel loves diesel loves that whole combustion engine and that deep bellowing sound to like the big boy engines coming into this tiny dinky little car and completely falling in love with it like how how is that even possible it makes no sense the braking in this vehicle is really nice i've heard about the one pedal technology so i'm going to push that I'm on one pedal, uh, one pedal technology, which is this. So what one pedal technology means, that green arrow there, or the green light there, uh, is basically that I don't need to use the brake now. So if I come off the gas, feel that? Really brakes. Do that one more time, so I come off the gas, and that's like I'm braking. This is showing the distance that we have from the cars. As long as the cars are greater than the second red light, then we're all good. That's a safe distance. Um, so that's a really good bit of technology as well. So on the one pedal technology, um, I just basically have to keep my foot on the gas now, which a lot of learners do. Um, so that could be an excellent part of learning to drive in this vehicle as well. Um, you won't need the brake pedal unless you really need it. And if you do need it, I'm going to test now. So I'm off the pedal with brakes, but then I'm adding additional brake. You feel that? You feel the difference when I got that extra bit of brake. Okay, I'm going to turn that one pedal technology off. If I can remember how, lane assist. Oh, lane assist. Is it working? Is it working? Is it working? We're in a bend. We're in a bend. A beep. Look, is it working? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, hang on. Just tell me to put my hands back on the wheel. There we go. Put my hands near the wheel. I'm going to accelerate a bit harder. Holy crap, can you see that? I'm not steering, I'm just accelerating. Because when the green lines are on, green lines are good. Green lines means it's active. Okay, so again, accelerating, um, staying in, in lane. So that's, that's amazing. Displaying the speed as well, okay? Like the other vehicles, we could probably get a warning chime. So this vehicle didn't have the warning chime. We've got a heated steering wheel. <laughs> the button's right there for the heated steering wheel. Heating steering on. The air conditioning's just making my hands too cold. So, you know, instead of changing the air vent to go away from my hands, I'll, I'll leave that on. You know, and uh, I'll just put the heat steering wheel on. Oh my God, I can feel it. Sold, sold Honda, sold. <laughs> it's a sick car, this thing's amazing. It's so cool, I love this thing, man. We're getting, look, we're getting love here. We're getting love from the big boy. Is he, is he electric? No, I thought he might be electric as well. But we're liking it, yeah? Even the guys in the big cars, this is giving us the flashes. <laughs> Everyone's loving it, giving some love, man. This is amazing. It's definitely the way forward. You know, the, the options there are for a bigger electric car. That option's there. Please, please guys, anyone that is watching this, write down in the comments, would you prefer to learn to drive in a big electric car or a small electric car like this? We're at 74% now, so we started at 82. Um, we're running down to 74% now, so that's a total of 8%. Look how many features there are here. Personal assistance, so you've got your own personal assistant, you've got navigation, there's your nav, you've got your telephone, you've got this menu, uh, which shows you all your geeky stuff. You've got your smartphone connector. Um, I mean, I mean, that's what you need, really. Uh, and then your phone can take over. Um, and then over here, we've got extra bits and pieces as well. This car is kitted out. Woo. There's your collision avoidance. It does have collision avoidance. So it beeped at me there and to warn me that I was getting too close. What do you think? Do you like that? 
Or that. Not that one. The camera. <laughs> you like the, the camera. camera there. Wow. Let's have a little look at the camera again. And your camera's got a, a, so this is the back mirror. So there's a normal mirror and there's your camera mirror. And it's also got a little battery indicator in the top right corner over here. I'm um, not quite sure if that means we're full or empty, <laughs> but that's your camera. So normal camera, normal camera. camera. <laughs> Amazing. 74% still. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Such a nice, comfortable drive as well. Um, the seats are comfortable. The seats are decent. They're comfortable. I like them. They're like a sofa. These are the leather ones. Okay. That's important for me. People are probably wondering why I'm getting so caught up in talking about why the seats are so comfortable. Um, because if you're sitting down in the car driving for a long period of time, it makes a huge difference. All right. And please, everybody, give us your feedback. So put it in park, switch your car off. It's been an absolute pleasure. My name's Scott. Stay safe, stay tuned. We'll see you next time.